All right, we're hopping on the wart chill train today. This is what I do, but there's more than one ways to shave a cat. First and foremost, don't make your own. It's a hassle. Learn from my mistakes. Some things in life you just buy, but I highly recommend buying it used if it's humanly possible. In short, the longer and wider the metal is, the faster it's going to cool, but the more expensive it's going to cost. Here's how I do it. Fill up a ton of ice the night before brew day. Never pay for ice. And if you do, I'm going to find out. It's going to be bad. This is a whole lettuce cabinet full. Put it in something big enough that's going to hold the ice and a chiller. I use a $30.15 gallon cooler from Walmart. Shop smart. This chiller is disgusting since I've never cleaned it, but it doesn't matter since it doesn't touch my wart. It just chills the hose water before it hits the smaller stainless steel chiller that's in my boil kettle. Here's the real MVP right here though, the hose thread that connects the two chillers. But the secret ingredient to cooling down fast, just stir the whole time.